uh, we gave it our all, and that's, that's all we need to ask for. That Maryland game, you know, they go on that run in the first half, and something starts to feel like Indiana or Michigan State or all over again, where those games are over in the first half. What do you think it says about you guys that you responded differently this time and made the game again before halftime? Um, I don't really think. No one ever thought the game was over. Um, we just didn't make some shots that we usually make. And, yeah, they made some shots, so uh, it kind of balanced out once the uh, game continued. And um, I don't think, you know, this team got the same type of identity. Uh, you know, we just never, you know, give up. So um, the fact that they were hitting shots and then we weren't, it was just kind of pretty much all the difference at that point. Sorry if these guys already asked you about the defense, but what have, what have you seen that, that needs to be addressed most dramatically in the next, you know, couple of games? Um, just the emphasis on uh, just really being there, uh, and, you know, helping the next guy, and um, you know, just just making it, you know, five against, you know, the ball against uh, opposed to, you know, where we watch film and it's been basically just one on one. So um, just the focus going forward is just playing better team defense. Uh, I don't think individually, you know, we can, we can point guys out and say they're not. Doing their job, we just we just got to do a better job as you know collective unit. So how, how's communication? Oh, the, the actual, the communication is actually really well amongst the team. It's just um, so, you know some games guys hit, like I said I said before some games guys are gonna be hot. You can't really control that, but uh, you know we've seen some things where it's all adjustable. So uh, when you look at it like that, it's, it's you know it's a positive. So uh, some things that can be adjusted, which is always good. How's it change the offense when Mark is able to hit shots like that? Uh, it just gives him a different uh, dynamic. Um, usually, his guys kind of, uh, you know, hovering around the, you know, the paint, uh, kind of can keeping us from, you know, getting in the lane and stuff like that. But you know, when he can hit shots like that, uh, you know, his guys stretched out and you know just open up. A different type of thing for offense. Beeline said after Sunday that Cam Chapman's starting to flow well with the offense. What's he done differently? I know he was kind of buried on the bench for a while there. Uh, at this point, I think it was just he just was. Uh, he never really got out of it mentally. Mm -hmm. uh, he didn't check out. He kept you know fighting and fighting and fighting every day. And uh, he got an opportunity and he capitalized on it. It was all about um, him getting an opportunity, pretty much. He, you know, the opportunity was there for him, and uh, you know he capitalized, made some shots, you know, made some good defensive plays, and you know going forward, I'm excited, you know, to see what he does next. Mark, does he hit the?